The avionics division of Hindustan Aeronautics has received clearance for the first ELM-2052 ASA radar to be fitted on the Jaguar Darren III standard aircraft, which will also be the first ASA radar to be fitted on any aerial platform in India. Hindustan Aeronautics had entered into a contract with Israel's Elta Systems in February 2020, for the manufacturing of 54 ASA radar systems under transfer of technology. The ELM-2052 is a fire control radar designed for air-to-air -air superiority and strike missions, and is based on fully solid-state active phased array technology, enabling the radar to achieve long detection ranges and multi-target tracking capabilities of 64 targets. Officials have said that the indigenous advanced towed artillery gun system will undergo winter user trials in January 2021, and summer user trials by mid-2021, and the complete user trials is expected to be completed by July 2021. The order for 150 units at an approximate cost of 3,365 crore rupees would be split in a 60-40 ratio between the L1 and L2 bidder, Bharat Forge and the Tata Power SED. The price for the bigger order of 1,580 systems will be negotiated, and local industry can bring the price down significantly. The Indian government has taken a significant step by authorizing the three armed forces to enhance their stocking of missiles and ammunition for 15 days enemy engagement, which is higher than the earlier 10 days stocking requirement. Making use of the emergency financial powers, the defense forces are expected to spend over 50,000 crore rupees for acquisition of equipment and ammunition from both local and foreign sources. The Koraput division of Hindustan Aeronautics has achieved a milestone of successful manufacturing and delivery of the 140th RD-33 Series 3 engine for the MiG-29 new PG fighter jets of the Indian Air Force. Hindustan Aeronautics license manufactures RD-33 MK engines, that provides a higher thrust than the basic variant, while featuring all its advantages such as unrestricted flight control and high stability against ambient disturbances. The engine also contains systems that reduces its infrared and optical visibility. The chairman of the U.S. National Security Commission on Artificial Intelligence Eric Schmidt has said that India and U.S. must create a strategic alliance for artificial intelligence technology and analysis on rising applied sciences within the area of defense. He also said that U.S. and India have room to develop, and it's crucial that the two countries work collectively to deal with these geopolitical challenges and fast advances in artificial intelligence. The National Security Guard conducted a four-day exercise in Goa, and the scope of the exercise was to counter multiple cities' multiple target scenario. The NSG mobilized six task forces in an incremental manner to Hyderabad and Goa, to validate its capability in counter operations at six simulated targets in both day and night conditions, and it is the first time when an exercise on this scale has been conducted by National Security Guard at the national level. Oh, my God.